Hello and welcome back to our YouTube channel. In this video, we will guide you through how to fix Apple TV verification failed. Step 1. Deleting the application data and cache of the Apple TV app. Go to the app that's causing issues, such as the Apple TV app. Press and hold the touchpad on your Apple TV remote until the app starts to jiggle. Press the play pause button and select delete to uninstall the app. Visit the App Store and reinstall the app. Step 2. Change the time and date setting on the phone. Navigate to the Settings menu on your TV. Select the General or System settings. Look for the Time or Date and Time settings. Check if the clock mode is set to Automatic or Manual. If it's set to Automatic, the TV should retrieve the date and time information from the broadcast signals or the network. If it's set to Manual, you can set the date and time manually. Check if the time zone is set correctly. If the time is not displayed correctly, there is a possibility that the time zone setting is not correct. Follow the steps to check the time zone setting and select your location. Step 3. Checking for updates on the Apple TV app. Open the Settings app on your Apple TV. Navigate to Apps and select Automatically Update Apps to turn it on or off. If automatic updates are turned off, you can manually update the app by going to the App Store, selecting the app, and choosing Update. If you have apps installed from multiple iTunes accounts, you will need to log in to each one to see updates. Step 4. Enable the Sony Smart TV services. To use the Apple TV app, AirPlay, and HomeKit, you will need to enable the Sony Smart TV services by accepting the Bravia TV privacy policy. If you experience Apple TV access or connection issues when pairing to an Apple device using the AirPlay app, follow these steps. On your supplied TV remote, press the Help button. Go to Status and Diagnostics, and then select Privacy Settings. On the Privacy Policy screen, read the Privacy Policy if you agree, scroll down to the very bottom of the policy, and then Agree, at least with respect to Sony Smart TV services, or select the Agree All option if you desire. On the TV remote control, press the input button and then select AirPlay from the input selection to display the AirPlay menu. Step 5. Uninstalling and reinstalling the app. Press and hold the app icon on the home screen until it jiggles. Tap the X on the app icon to delete it. Confirm the deletion when prompted. Open the App Store on your device. Search for the Apple TV app. Tap the Get button to download and install the app. Step 6. Edit and disable the two-factor authentication in security. Sign into your Apple ID account page. Under Security, select Edit. Click Turn off two-factor authentication. Follow the on-screen instructions to confirm that you want to turn off two-factor authentication. Step 7. Sign out from iCloud in your phone and re-login. Open the Settings app on your iPhone. Tap on your name at the top. Scroll down to the bottom of the page and tap Sign out. Enter your Apple password and confirm your decision. After you sign out, you can sign in again by opening the Settings app, tapping Sign In, and entering your Apple ID and password. Thanks for watching. Subscribe for more videos.